Okay, folks, so this is day 34 of asking for Sean to be returned to Street Fighter in Street Fighter 6. And this one actually I just thought of not even that long ago. It's actually a pretty interesting concept. And because I know I'm going to have a good while to explain this, I'm going to go over this in as much detail as possible. So, for all of those who have played Street Fighter over the many years and seen the different games and media that are around it. One thing that is very interesting to me that could be incorporated into Street Fighter 6, especially because of this character's condition in the game, which would be Violent Ken making a return in Street Fighter 6. Hear me out. In Street Fighter Alpha 3, Bison overtakes Ken's mind. That's why you have to fight him as Ryu. With that in mind, knowing that that happened, and it was depicted the same way in the Street Fighter 2 animated movie, Bison took over Ken's mind, powered him up. And we also know that Violent Ken became a thing with SVC Chaos, SNK versus Capcom. And then Violent Ken ended up being in the most recent iteration of Street Fighter 2. All you have to do is you can nix the SNK versus Capcom thing, but just all you have to do is say that Bison's influence had been just sitting around in Ken's mind, like just a small bit, just a small bit, just a little bit there since the incident in Street Fighter Alpha 3. Now, it's not like Bison takes over Ken. It's just his influence is still there in his mind, which could also explain the fall off of his character and how he became basically a bum in comparison to who he was. Why he became so obsessed with fighting in a way that he wasn't before. Which, that would be interesting to do. And then have Sean actually encounter him in this state. After his first initial, uh, initial, initial run-in with him. Where he beats Ken. And Ken just descends further down into the darkness in his mind. Because he just felt sorry for himself. He pitied himself. And then this power comes out of him and takes over. This would be the perfect time for this type of thing to happen with Ken because his mind is usually very strong. But with his mind in such a terrible state, with him not being as confident in himself as he was, I could see this power overtaking him and then Sean has to fight him. Not just Sean, but Sean is like the first person to have to fight him in this situation. Damn, that means Sean would have to do it violent Ken and Dark Sakura based on what I said. 